increase the size of the camera. Select both objects and move them to top left. Now add the expression image. I copied X axis from the circle to the expression. Add destroy delay script to the circle. By putting 10 means it will get destroyed after 10 seconds. Add Polygon Collider 2D expression. Click the arrow next to point. Change the size of element 0 to 3. Click this icon to edit the collider shape. Change element 1 size to 3. Add rigid body, gravity 0, x, y, z, true. Add tag wall. I disabled the circle just to test the expression. That's good. Enable circle back again. Add straight line. Change this rotation to 90 if you want to make it vertical. Add rigid body XYZ through gravity 0. Collision detection continues. Add box collider 2D. I made folder for obstacles prefabs. Prefab the expression and the straight line. Covering the whole camera POV area by duplicate and place. Ctrl D to duplicate. Change the X size to make it smaller for some areas. Duplicate ball marble to the amount that you want. If you are using my script, do the same as I do, please. I placed 10 marbles, colored each one. Hit play for test. Name your marbles same as mine. If it's wrong, the script won't work. And create tags like this list. As example, white marble should have tag named white M. And the letter M is capital. To make everything balanced, I made a sketch in Photoshop. You can find this sketch in the resources folder. Like smart Pendo made it. Change the alpha of the sketch to half. I'm following the sketch and placing all the elements. Add Polygon Collider 2D. Change size to 3. Add Rigid Body 2D. XY True. Keep Z False and Gravity 1. 
it's ready to prefab the triangle. Ctrl D to duplicate. Add straight line. Press T and resize it. I forgot to make the plus shape. Import plus shape to Unity. You can add two collider boxes 2D or polygon 2D. For polygon, change the size to 12. Grab each point to the corner. Rigid body 2D XY true Add circle shape Change the order layer to 1 XY true gravity 0 Add Circle Collider 2D For this shape, I used Straight Line Prefab Change Rigid Body X and Y to True Select all straight lines around the scene. Right click in the hierarchy, create empty parent, name it to walls. Do the same thing for the elements. Disable the sketch Everything looks good except the square shapes Making background image Add it to the scene Don't worry about the colored squares I'll explain it in a few seconds Give the sketch order in layer minus 10 Here I added the green square sprite Just to fill the finished green I call this colored squares Teleport Drag square shade to the scene Add box collider 2D Set is it triggered to true Duplicate this square Name the first one TP Name the new duplicated one to spawner Add teleporter script to the TP
change span or size to a smaller size. Parent TP to the spawner by dragging spawner into TP inside the hierarchy. Click on the TP, drag spawner to the new pose transform in the script. TP ready to prefab. Change the name to the color you want, as example, tp underscore red. Spawner color should be the same. Make spawner alpha to half. Duplicate tp and place it to the other end lines. Rename tp underscore green. Don't forget to change the spawner color. This should be the same color of the last one. Rename it to TP underscore green loose. Don't change anything about the spawner of all the loose TP. Repeat same thing to other. First blue is normal, second blue is loose. First pink is normal, second pink is loose, and so on. Disable all loose spawner. Now click on the green loose TP, drag the spawner of the normal green to the script of green loose and same for all other loose tp drag the spawner of the normal blue to the script of the blue loose look at every tp how they work or you can test it by placing the ball above tp directly for saving time white Teleported back because it touched red and cyan passed to the next one because it touched green Here is just time-lapse me Testing fixing issues and retesting it Careful when you resize the TP it will affect to its spawner balls can stuck here So I made the plus smaller Right click on the scale and click apply. By doing that it will make change to the ordinal prefab and every plus in the scene will get affected. Export it to exe file. File, build settings, PC, build. Run the exe file and it's done.